Hey guys, it's Joy here with White Lines. We are out in Flakau at Absolute Park, testing new gear for winter 22-23. This is the Battalion Push-Up. This is a women's all-mountain ripper that's built for any day and every day of the season. Let's give it to our test team and see what they make of it. A perennial favourite in the women's battalion lineup, the push up is their versatile, fun loving, all mountain machine. There is so much potential here, and any intermediate rider who wants to progress across the whole mountain should definitely take a closer look. Winner of numerous industry accolades, the push up impressed our test team in a variety of conditions and terrain to secure its place in the White Lines 100. It is a go anywhere, do anything snowboard that packs a hell of a lot of value for money in there when you consider you're getting one snowboard to do it all. So, how does it fare on the groomers? Our crew were united in their opinion on this one. It rips. Smooth was a word that got thrown around a lot here. Even calves, stable charging, and dominant through the crud and the chunder. This is thanks in part to this full camber profile, but Battalion have added just a little spice with some carbon layups to bolster performance and beef up the response without interfering with the overall slightly more mellow flex pattern. In addition to triple base technology, Battalion's sidekicks further increase the uplifts at the widest point of the snowboard, giving you the ability to handle the chop and slop easier than ever before. Many brands now fly the 3D shaping flag, but Battalion were way ahead of the curve with their triple base tech. There's no terrain that doesn't feel the benefit of it, but for me, I personally feel the most profit when riding in deeper snow. It comes back again to this hole-like shape in the nose, or the tail if you're riding switch. Where a traditional camber snowboard tends to submarine in powder, the push-up's 3D shape allows it to stay on top of the snowpack. It may only have been ankle-deep fresh snow, but there was no doubting the ease of use of the push-up in the side country. If expanding your freestyle repertoire is on your bucket list for this season, then you'll be pleased to hear that Battalion's triple base tech is still the ultimate get out of jail free card. And while the push-up isn't a freestyle specific snowboard, the uplifts in the nose and tail offer unparalleled forgiveness when you're riding park. Whether you're scuffing landings or worried about catching a burr on a rail, you get the leeway to make a mistake without paying the blood price. This camber profile gives a little extra pep in your step for getting airborne, but it's not so aggressive that you'll find it causes a problem with smaller, more jibby features. Our test team reported high levels of stoke from bigger kickers all the way to tech rail maneuvers. The push-up has been doing the rounds for years, steadily making its way into many riders' lists of favourites, and for good reason. It's a safe bet for pretty much anyone, especially those who don't want to pigeonhole their snowboarding. If you're unsure of the type of conditions you'll be riding or you're planning to spend a considerable length of time in the mountains, then the push-up is able to have your back from a big midwinter dump all the way to late season slash slashing. So that's our thoughts on the 22-23 Battalion push-up, a one-stop shop for all your snowboarding needs. If you've got any questions, pop a comment below and we'll make sure to get back to you.